Hi, friends! How we diddly doing? Gotta get my game open. How we doing? How was your Saturday? Hey, Drawn and Faded and Kaylee and Tony and Richard! Hello! Good morning! Good afternoon! Morning? Afternoon? Can't remember. Don't you even think this is a Christmas song? Ooh, good luck, Faded. How we doing? Morning. Okay, I was like, I couldn't remember the time difference. Couldn't, I couldn't the time difference. I couldn't, oh, sorry. Oh, don't unmute that. Gross. Blech. Sorry. How we doing? Nice, Kaylee. Were the car, the car cars, the car crodontosaurus is making you crazy? You're like, what are you, nine hours ahead of me, Richard, I think? Something like that? It's not a Christmas song. Guys, if you were at Clinton's stream, I was talking the whole time. Hey, Blake! That's all good. Have a good night. Sleep well. If you were in Clinton's stream, I was freaking talking the whole time. <laughs> oh, did they? Congrats, Kaylee. That's awesome. I know. I was talking the whole time, but he had me down the whole way in Discord, so no one heard except for Crow and Brobra. Fuming. <laughs> yeah, because he had me down. He had everyone else up but me. Didn't think to check it, you know. Of course. Yeah. Grinding lines, it's 7.50 here. Oh, okay, so you're seven hours ahead of me. Okay, cool. I don't know. I don't know. He literally, I've been talking, I was talking to Crow and Scarecrow the whole time. They were answering me. <laughs> and he had no, re like, he had no idea. He, like, didn't notice. And I was, like, wondering, like, I was answering people in chat and I was like wondering why they weren't like acknowledging that someone was asking where I was. He just forgot. Like, I think it was a setting that just hadn't been changed because Discord has so many updates so often that like sometimes things get changed. He didn't do it on purpose. He just didn't check that to make sure I was up. So yeah, I was talking the whole time. Like I wasn't being antisocial. I was talking, bro, bro was answering me, Brobra and Crow were answering me, and I asked them, I'm like, can you guys hear me? And they're like, yeah. So anyway, uh, hi Gunhub. I'm great, thanks. How are you? <laughs> it's not rude. It, it's fine. I don't know. It's fine. I have a beer. I'm good. I finished a mule. I had a beer. It's fine. It was just me making inappropriate jokes about how I'm Bigfoot's my man. It's fun. So today, guys, I thought it would be fun. Uh, we're going to start this parquet stream with blasting some wet beef along the coast with the 300 and the 470. I thought that would be fun. And then we're going to probably look at Black Buck. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. We might look at Axis. Do you... I, we're just gonna play it by ear. It's late now, so like it's almost 1 a.m. So who knows what we're gonna do, but I definitely wanna blast some wet beef with the 470 and the 300. I'm definitely feeling in that mood right now, <laughs> just to blast things. Hey, Dustin, how are you? Good to see you. Oh, what are you looking for uh, in classic, Gunhub? Johnny. Yes, Parquet. Johnny, I was talking the whole stream. I was talking the whole stream. Brobra and Crow could hear me. <laughs> no, no, no. Not not pigs. I have a not pig grind on Rancho. We don't need that. Whitetail. Ooh, which map? Yeah, because he had me down. For whatever reason, he had me down the whole way. I don't know if that like that was like a trend like happened in an update or what. And I was talking, your brother could hear me, Brobra could hear me, and he couldn't. And he didn't think it was weird that I wasn't talking. Like, come on. I haven't shut up since I started talking in his streams, you know? 
I need to grab the red dot sight for the 470. I mean, I probably don't, but it might be nice. So I grabbed another beer. I grabbed a beer. I had a mule. I grabbed a beer. Yeah. What was, what? Not pigs? What if it was a super rare? Then yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna grab the red dot sight. <laughs> I think that's what the, the 470 takes. Not that I probably need it, but we're gonna take it. <laughs> Tony! <laughs> nice. And we're gonna shoot Blossom Wet Beef. Now this is the, uh, this used to be like the best spot up here for wet beef. Did I even turn it to wet beef time? I did, but then I like, I'll read, I'll change the time back. The 6.5? No. Hey, Flanky. How are you guys? What, have you guys been playing Valheim today? Red Feather, nice, Gun Hub. Yeah, Water Buffalo. Only like six hours, nice. All right, we're gonna do some wet beef today. I don't, I think my, yeah, I used to have a tree stand, but it got destroyed by the parquet beavers, so. Does anyone know, let me, actually, you know what? Let me just pull up Pro XCK's thing. <laughs> let me just pull up Pro XCK's hotspot map for parquet. Oh, they're the whole way up the coast. Okay. Nice. Oh, you might want to see the game. I don't know. Maybe. I was too busy ranting. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> too busy ranting. Anyway. Hey, TTK. Hey, Cody. She said me still my favorite rifle. Do like the inline muzzleloader. Yes. I love both muzzleloaders. Blanky the cowboy? Let's go. You don't have one? Dang. Okay, let's start up here, I guess. Pro XCK's map says they start up here. How we doing, guys? I just got, um, defeated by my man Bigfoot. On Clinton's stream. Despite you guys not being able to hear. Oh my gosh, look, this matches my shirt. Let's go. I'm like agitated. I'm sorry. Are they? Nice, John. Yeah, sorry if I'm a little agitated, but <laughs> I'll try to I'll try to calm down. Yeah, TGK, I had a mule earlier. But I played Bigfoot with Crow, Brobra, and Clinton, and Clinton didn't have my voice up at all, so the stream didn't hear me. He didn't hear me the whole time for like an hour. For like an hour and a half. He didn't, like, he didn't even, like, I thought he was just ignoring me, to be honest. And then, like, Crow and Brobra were answering me, and he didn't even, like, think, like, oh, that's weird. Whatever. <laughs> Um, so now I'm a little agitated, I won't lie. <laughs> and I have a beer. <laughs> also, guys. Ooh, water buffalo. We're just gonna blast water buffalo for a little bit. I have the 300 as well. But I figured we'd take the 470 out, because why not? <sighs> nice. I can't pass up Bigfoot. I haven't played for so long and I only like to play with people because there's no way I'm defeating Bigfoot alone. Like I could probably do Faz alone, but I could definitely not do Bigfoot alone. 
Definitely not. Nah, I was already drinking, Dustin. It's Saturday, you know. What bear is it or beer? <laughs> bear or beer? <laughs> Ooh, nice gun hub. Ooh, cinnamon teal. Let's just blast the cinnamon teal. I had to take the catchatory out of my pocket because the freaking 470 is very heavy. Beer. Great one, beer. It is. It's from a PA brew, a Pennsylvania brewery. Sorry, PA. Us Pennsylvanians call it PA. Called Broken Heels IPA. I know, TJK. <laughs> you ain't never seen daylight here on this channel, none. It's from New Trail Brewing uh, in Pennsylvania. It's a hazy IPA. I don't think I've seen Peccary on this map. I say that all the time, Johnny. I don't know what you're talking about. I think I've seen Hollow, uh, she... Hollow, I think, played No Man's Sky. Ooh, a feed zone, nice. Caitlin. You wanna go this way? <laughs> Come on. Get it together. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, TTK. So I'm trying to get my mind off the bears because I really want to, I would love to do the bears, however, I don't want to get the great one black bear while Nate is absent, because I feel like he should be here when I great, get the great one black bear, since he so graciously showed us, let us see his takedown of his great one whitetail, and also just because I want him to be here when it spawns, so... Um, I needed something to get my mind off of black bears <laughs> and that grind and I didn't feel like I, w I wanted to play Call of the Wild so I figured we might as well just scour my, uh, this might be boring by the way, but I figured we might as well just scour my Parquet Fernando ma map and just destroy some water buffalo, some wet beef because it's fun, uh, <laughs> because it's fun. Really, Dustin? Why is that? Nate. Nate is currently... Actually, guys. So, Nate is currently in the National Champi Championship for College Fishing um, in Florida right now, in Kissimmee. He is... Uh, he has practice tomorrow and probably Monday. And then the tournament is the 21st through the 23rd. And I'll be posting this in Discord, but every day at 3 p.m. EST, there are live weigh-ins streamed on a site. And I will post it in the announcements, but if you want to see how he did each day, uh, you can watch it live. So, um, but yeah, he's currently at a fishing tournament for his college fishing. And obviously we want to send him all the good vibes that he's going to be placed well. Um, but yeah, so he's not in the streams currently because he's away and I don't want to get the great one black bear without him. Oh. He's become, ow, he's become an integral part of our, of our channel here. So it would be weird not to have him here when the great one spawns, you know? So we're just going to ignore black bear grinding as hard as it is. <laughs> I'm, it's already hard enough not doing it live, or not doing it off stream. Ow. Those are expensive rounds, by the way. I hope you understand that. Oh. Die. 
Anyway. Okay, let's read. At first, I want to send. You can't make tech leggings. All you need is the the feet, right? Right. Congrats, David. I mean, yeah, I feel like it'd be weird. It's more, it, it's, I'm selfishly doing that, right? Because I want Nate to be here. Oh, yeah. I feel like Call of the Wild oh. is one of those things that benefits from, uh, like, a time away from it. For sure. Isn't there like a strange rare for water buffalo or like isn't the gray kind of is rare or something? Is that correct? Oh, gotcha, Kaylee. Oh, okay, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Hey, Luke, welcome in. New face. Good to see you. Hope you had a good Saturday. This, uh, oh. hey! You're not gonna have a good Saturday. Orange and albino, but I thought one was. All right, have you been in the spicy juice, Johnny? <laughs> have you been in spicy juice? Should we be concerned? I mean, you're of age. Plus, I always get something good on map when I return. Nice, yeah. So for those of you who are unaware, um, I only have two species left in the park game missions that I need to finish. I only need a red deer and the black buck. And uh, a month ago or two months ago, I got a diamond or I got a level five black buck that trolled me on my map. And it has to be on my map. So eventually I do want to get all of my black buck zones and probably do a mini grind if I don't find a diamond. Because I think a diamond is still possible. Like, I would assume. Spread out. <clears throat> or another troll. <laughs> but anyway, um, I want to find my black buck zones and then probably start a, a grind so I get the uh, diamond. I feel like the diamond red deer is going to be pretty easy um, in comparison. Uh, but I don't know if I'm up for looking in the... I, as much as I love nighttime hunting, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I love the nighttime hunting. But uh, I, don't, I don't know if I'm up for it on this map tonight. Hot sauce is always good. True. I like sriracha. Black is uncommon, or at least on the spreadsheet. Okay, yeah, I have the AA Ron spreadsheet, so I was thinking that. Tallulah. I like sriracha. I love sriracha. I put sriracha on eggs. I have a love-hate relationship with eggs. Um, so like, I often, I need to have a carb usually to be able to stomach eggs. But like, if it's um scrambled eggs, I can usually eat them as long as I put ketchup or sriracha on them. There we go, Johnny. Good job. Claps for Johnny. Hey Cobra, how are ya? Good to see ya. Guys, have you liked the stream? Help me calm down by liking the stream. Help me uh, get get my zen back. Please and thanks. Nah, so like if I overthink eggs, I get a little queasy. I've like, it's like mind over matter, but if I think about it too much, I get a little queasy, I won't lie. I gotta have a pancake or like a toast to sop that ish up, you know? 
<laughs> very, very angry. I'm so angry. <laughs> now I'm just a little irritated, I won't lie. <laughs> a little irritated, I won't lie. You know, when you think you're being ignored for an hour. Nice, Dustin. You know, it's funny, like, earlier in the week I was having some, like, indigestion or, like, heartburn in my esophagus, but it's gone away, so that's been nice. But I don't know if I'm... I wasn't brave enough to try some sriracha on my stir-fry tonight, so... We'll wait. Thanks for liking, guys. I appreciate you. I'm not angry, I'm just irritated. There's a difference. You know, it's like when you've got, when your sock falls down in your shoe. You know what I'm talking about? Why do I have this accent? I don't know. It's just coming out. I can't help it. I can't help it. Um, but you know, when, when the, when your sock has fallen down in your shoe, and, uh, it's just like super irritating. That's how I feel right now. My sock has been down in my shoe. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. It's not hot. Sriracha has a good flavor. So like, I think it tastes better than like, say, Frank's or something. This is a nice flavor. That's why I like it so much. Actually, behind me on the bar, I have a sriracha cookbook. No, not on the bar. Never mind. I have a bartender's friend book. Uh, in my room, I have a sriracha cookbook that I haven't really looked at. <laughs> no. No. I won't have revenge. But I'm just like, how do you not notice? Like, we all know that I talk a lot. Like, how do you not notice that I'm not talking? You know what I mean? Anyway. Hey, Ian. <laughs> or your underwire gets all up. Whoa, are you wearing, you're, you're wearing underwire, Ian? Interesting, interesting. Taking notes. <laughs> interesting. Interesting. I have I haven't had Cholula. I should probably try that. No no no. It tastes better than Frank's. I didn't say it was better. I said it tastes better. Because Frank's kinda tastes gross, I'm not gonna lie. The taste isn't that great. Oh, by the way, you need quick cash and you have a nine class nine weapon? Wet beef. <laughs> underwire instead of underwear. <laughs> I like the visual of you wearing an underwire, Ian, okay? That's hilarious. Got your pecs in an underwire? Maybe. Got your pecs all up in an underwire. Yeah, I call them wet beef. That's what Hollow and I call them, which is funny because Hollow's allergic to beef. Hollow is allergic to beef, so we call them wet beef, which is like gross, but then like it's super gross because she's allergic. Anyway. True, Johnny. I mean, I whatever it's holding up in underwear. I don't want to. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Thanks, Tony. Under right. <laughs> yeah, you might want to reconsider your underwear preferences, Ian. Yeah, could you? I, what is the you know i get um i don't know why because like i don't have a man in my life i don't know why but i get these uh like 
I get these advertisements for underwear that are for men that like, you know, hold a s certain junk up, um, <laughs> like a hammock. And I don't know why, but they seem like they'd be nice. But could, I was just imagining those with like an underwire in them though, rather than just cloth. I don't know, push up for your boys. Why what? <laughs> I mean, the, on the advertisement, the men are very happy with it because it's keeping things from sticking and stuff. You know? You know? <laughs> yeah, I have to ask you about your underwire every time you come in here now. I mean, that's a personal question though. Never mind. <laughs> nah. I don't need no. I don't need no hooking up with nobody. Mm-hmm. I get that too, Dustin. Like, literally, I ordered uh, Domino's. I got the tater tots from Domino's, the loaded tots from Domino's the other day. And uh, I literally have advertisements for them now. And I didn't even look them up. Guys, there's a new command on this channel. I'm very excited about it. No one knows about it yet, but... Anyway. Nah. Just because I get advertisements for men's underwear does not mean I need a man. You know? There, there's not a, no it's not bears we already have a bear aim command oh man nah Nate has commands that he's asked for he doesn't get his own command it's one that you guys use that you like you think it should be a command but it's not it hasn't been. Oh, you'll guess it pretty easily. Because I don't know if I'll... I don't know if it'll be used in this stream, but... Nice, Ian. Okay. <laughs> well, I mean... <laughs> um... I think it has multiple meanings, Dustin. <laughs> Small small me Collared peccary are over here? Nice. It definitely has multiple meanings. Should I be recording? Do you think I should be recording? Probably. I guess there's something funny. Or not. It's fine. Oh, there we go. Ew. No. <laughs> that would be like... F you... No. <laughs> Right now, if I made that command, it would not be nice. <laughs> yeah, it's a command now, but don't cheat. Don't, don't, don't cheat. Nope. It's something that you guys spam sometimes, and it hasn't been a command until now. Gross. <laughs> hey, he sounds better. I talked to him like two days ago in a voice chat and he sounds much better. Uh, no hype. Nope. I can't get those emotes on, uh, I have to put them in Nightbot, right? So. Oh, you should have, Johnny. Why not? Do it. Do it. You should have joined when, uh, well, David joined eventually, and he was accusing me of certain things, but we're not going to talk about that here. <laughs> they were spamming Ohio. 
<clears throat> They're spamming the word Ohio for whatever godforsaken reason. There are a few buffalo there. Why are seven so big? <laughs> Nightbot, I love that. <gasps> no, it, it ain't. It ain't Ohio. That was almost a blacklisted word. What are you talking about? <laughs> Heck no, man. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> hey, Will, you mock him in. New face. Good to see you. Do this from here. Uh, yeah, yeah, totally, totally. I could totally do this from here. That, that, that looks great. Wow, zap. Sure, go ahead, subscribe if you want, if you think you're gonna like it here. We're kind of weird, I won't lie. We meaning me, myself, and I, my chatters are great. Actually, we get, chat gets a little weird. But yeah, if you want to subscribe, please feel free to do so. Um, I haven't been posting as much video content because I stream every night and I do have a day job, but uh... If I get good stuff, I will definitely stream or post videos. Oh, well then you'll fit right in here, William. Welcome in. Tonight we're a little spicy because I'm having some adult beverages. True, TTK. That's true. Thanks, TTK. I appreciate it. That would be to see someone say that they are from Ohio and they get kicked because... Well, no, the blacklisted words don't kick them. It just makes it so they can't say Ohio. And it would be like Ohio by itself rather than like in a phrase. No, mm, no, I wouldn't say that, TGK. No, 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 no. I, I have a job outside of YouTube because I don't get paid here, but no, definitely not. I had a mule earlier and I'm drinking a beer, yes. Cheers. Yeah, that's a uh, that's one of that's one of Nate's commands. Right, Ian? <laughs> Normal takes work. That's gross. Oof, hard shot. Can I just put that in my random like compilation? Actually, that's pretty good. <laughs> Please give us a hint. Um, let me think of a good hint that won't give it away. Yeah, please don't self promote. We would love to have you here, but self promotion is kind of prohibited. Um, a hint. Let me think of. Usually it's something, it's a command that Jebba and Nate usually spam. Well, last night they were trying to guess someone's name and that was a lot. Thanks, William. I appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> no, Faded. I'm not that mean. Mmm. There we go. Good job. Uh, so close. So close. You're getting there. Warmer. I was like, who put grind in there? <laughs> Could you imagine? Hands. It's all in the hips. What? <laughs> what? <clears throat> you guys are close. <laughs> Nope. You guys are- you're getting colder now. Kaylee. Mm, nope. Colder. 
You you were on it. What? Nope. You had it and then you didn't have it. <clears throat> ah! There you go. There you go. <laughs> TTK, ding ding ding, you got it. <laughs> I was gonna say, TTK got it. Let's wash hands. No, 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 TTK, you got it. Oh, Brontosaurus, Brontosaurus stomp. Let's go. Yeah, you got it, TTK. I think, who was it, Kaylee? I forgot the extra H for hands. It was just wash hands. <laughs> Washins. Nice. <laughs> All good, Dustin. <laughs> it was, Johnny. You were close. I do sometimes, William, but because I'm on PC. I just like, I'm afraid that I'm gonna run into a modded server. Um, our, our friend CJO, who streams during the day, uh, he was recently on a Verhanga server and he found some suspicious animals that were definitely modded and I'm just like worried that's gonna happen. He had to like delete a diamond jackal and uh, I just don't wanna have to do that. I don't wanna be, you know, disappointing people, so. I just usually stay on my solo, my single player. Um, <clears throat> we do a lot of black bear grinding on this here uh, channel <laughs> until we get the next, my second black bear great one, but uh, we're putting that on hold currently. Mm hmm. Yeah, it was so sad. Because it was crazy. Like, <clears throat> if he hadn't searched the rest, right, like, the way he found the jackal seemed natural and normal enough, but then he found the spring bucks, the two level five spring bucks in one herd, and then he's found the other level nine jackal, and it's like, ah, oh, man, that's just painful. Who are you? Hey, come back. Whoa! Are they feeding at this time? Are you feeding? Guys, what have we found a level five? Could you imagine? We'll spend five hours trying to get it. Excuse me? <clears throat> yeah, exactly, Ian. I do not mod. I do not mod my black bears. If I modded them, I would have like a a max score, max weight one, and a super rare. <laughs> you got a new snake, William? That's awesome. What kind of snake? <clears throat> we know your tricks. Haha. <laughs> oh, it was a few weeks ago, Kaylee. Yeah, I'd have, like, all the... If I were modding, I would do it. <sighs> you know for a fact I would, like have a cinnamon super at least. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I would have an orange, a diamond orange water buffalo because that's one of the super rares I also want. Little known fact. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. Love that. 20 foot python? Burmese? Holy 20 feet! That sounds like it's human eating range. Right? There are like pink lines or whatever. I've seen those.
These are like so expensive, these rounds. It eats... Holy cow, man. Is that expensive? I swear, I, I would assume it's expensive to keep it fed. Piebald and Nista, great one, yeah. Real life Titan Boa, yeah. <laughs> oh. okay. Yeah, I like. Hey, hey, dude. How are you? You okay? No. Oh. $233? But they don't eat that often. Like, is that once a month? Like, how often does it eat that? Because they don't eat it that often, right? Night, oh. TGK. Thanks for hanging out with us. I will murder you. But, like, maybe not right now. <laughs> I'm not ranged properly. There we go. There we go. Guys, I took the water buffalo down with, um... With one of the pistols, like the with the uh, Glock or something. It was stupid. Boom, boom. <laughs> there you go. Two times a two times a week. No way. You have to feed it two times a week. Are you sh what? Wait a minute. You have to feed it. You have to feed it. 23 pound pig two times a week? What? Is this your first snake? Or is this like, have you had snakes before? I've been lucky on the cheaters I come across so far. I've only seen speed hackers. Yeah, I've only seen speed hackers as well. Actually, no, no, no. I was in a latent server and the level five Coyotes had max weight tracks, so. Yeah, it's not cheap. No, I have had snakes, okay. Jumped on top of a white tail and had a talk about him giving up his great uncle. Oh, sorry to hear that, Ian. Hopefully it spawns soon for you. Hey, Fakus! Welcome in! I thought about getting a Gaboon Viper. If I change my mind, I'll just watch YouTube videos. You know, I have- I'm- I'm slightly arachnophobic. You can hold it. Cool. I'm slightly arachnophobic, but I've watched videos of people who own tarantulas and like have watched tarantulas mating. Like mating videos because it's very interesting. I'm like one of those weird people that like to learn things no matter if it's like a phobia. <laughs> no matter if it's a phobia. Um, and yeah, I watched like this video of like tarantulas mating. Yeah, it's very interesting. They like thump. They like, uh, like thump on the glass and stuff. It's very interesting. A tree boa, nice. What, co what color are these? these snakes what does your boa eat and how big is it I can't help it like yeah like I can't help like the want for knowledge and like knowing things outweighs the terif how terrified I am of spiders like I like to know these things okay like I like to have random trivia so if I ever find myself in cash cab, I can like stand a chance, you know? It's very... Rats once a week? Okay. Do you just keep those frozen then? So it's, it's a smaller snake, I assume. Well, I mean, if dinosaurs are like birds, they're like, you know? We're not gonna get into that. <laughs> oh, I love bees. <clears throat> I love bumblebees. I love when bumblebees get those cute little pollen sacks on their on the side of their legs from going to flower to flower. Ooh, I bet Ian. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm claustrophobic as well, slightly. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> hey, Jaden. Nah, we're just blasting. I'm just... I'm just entertaining chat at this point. I, not with the game. Python eats pigs and the tree boa rats once a week and the python is white and yellow and the tree boa is green. I was hoping the boa is green, like a lime green. I love that. They are cool, but I don't want to be... <laughs> Johnny. <laughs> love that. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. <laughs> Anyway. You don't like snakes. I like snakes over spiders any day. Five sure. One hundred percent ho. Aw, thank you, Ian. I try. <laughs> I try, man. <laughs> <laughs> Even if it's like at the expense of me, I try. Thank you. I appreciate that. Ooh, sugar gliders are so cute. One of his snakes will eat your sugar glider, but that's cute. <laughs> nice. Ooh, gross. Eek. Yeah, that'd be scary. Yeah. There are people who like sleep with them. Like they'll put them in their bed with them. I'm like, but what happens when they start constricting you? Like, come on. <laughs> I want to get a snake, but I don't know which one to get. And also the house I'm in at the moment, I can't control temperatures. So Ooh, yeah. Makes sense. <laughs> Guess what your dad has? Outside of a snake? Does he have a bunch of tarantulas or something? I quit, it quit eating because it was preparing for a big meal and yeah, that's what she did. Let it sleep with her and Bet said that's a big no-no. Yeah, like especially constrictors, like you can just easily cut off your breathing and stuff. Gross. I want a gecko. I feel like they display me very well. Interesting. A, a copperhead? Excuse me? We got copperheads here in Pennsylvania. Copperheads are cool because, well, not cool, but I mean their pattern's cool. They look like Hershey Kisses, which is very fitting for Pennsylvania because of Hershey's chocolate. But copperheads are cool because they don't release their venom completely. They give like a warning bite, which might not contain the full potency of their venom. How does he have a copperhead? That's crazy. Aw, oh, the cute little jumping spiders. Oh, really faded? Yeah, that makes sense, Justin. I'm allergic to wasp wings. I've also been wanting a snake tattoo because I love reptiles. Cool gun hub. I want a few tattoos someday. When I get money and a and a and good artists. I've skinned many copperheads, found these Round these parts, cowpoke! <laughs> nice. This one is not venomous. Interesting. Interesting. How's that? <laughs> Flanky. I had a goldfish once. <laughs> Do you have six... <laughs> Ooh. 
Yes. My grandma's ducks, geese, and chickens. Wow. Interesting. You took all the venom out? Are you sure they can't just make more? Or do you like remove venom sacks? How does that work? Very curious. You have several ideas? Cool. I definitely like when I visit, and I say when I visit just so I'm putting it in the universe. When I visit Hollow in Portugal, I think she and I will be getting matching like T-Rex feet or something. Like we're gonna get like matching dinosaur tattoos because our friendship was formed over Ark, playing Ark. That's where we solidified our friendship. So I think we're gonna get like matching T-Rex feet or something uh, when I finally, when I visit her in Portugal. I have a horse, a cow, 26 chickens, six ducks, one rac a raccoon. Interesting. Not, oh, named Terry, not Tom. Two dogs, five cats, beat that. Nit. Snap their fangs off. Ew. Nope, they don't reproduce more venom. Oh, okay. Interesting. So they're like born with a set amount of venom and then you just like remove it? Interesting. Kind of like the scent glands of skunks. Very interesting. See, I love learning. Excuse you? I will destroy you all. Do not touch me. I would love to have a pet raccoon. YouTube algorithm is crazy. One night I picked up a jumping spider in my house to throw it outside and the first video I see when I hop on YouTube is how to take care of- No way. Ah, I hate that. Ah. Aw, sorry when- Sorry you lost a rabbit, Johnny. Sounds good, Gun Hub. Terry's wild, but I have pet him at least five times. Interesting. Very interesting. How are y'all doing? <laughs> mm. No. Am I bo are you bothering? No, definitely not, William. I like to learn, man. I appreciate it. Sweet. Weird. What do you think happened, Johnny? Strange. Oh, that's sick, Gunhub. Oh, I love that. Obviously. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Look at the... <laughs> no, definitely not, William. Drawn, you would get a diamond black buck, you little nasty. What are you doing? A heart attack? What? Is that common in rabbits, Johnny? See, I'm just learning about all the things tonight. Appreciate it. get like super excited I'm afraid my dog's gonna have a heart attack one of these days because he's super anxious in his old age and I'm like man you gotta calm the F down Tah. probably blink <gasps> I should I can't make emotes well I can make them for the discord but I can't make them for here yet until I Till I get the, the members and the monetizations and the things, but 
definitely a nasty emote. Like, nasty and like, like, kind of looks like Slimer, maybe? Nah. Agreed, William. Never too late to learn. Who are you? Weird. Like a nasty, yeah, like a nasty and like a Slimer, like green. Really, gonna? Weird. Not sick. Night drawn. Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it, except not your diamond black buck. We don't appreciate that none. I'm just kidding. Congrats, dude. Congrats. I remember when my dog died last year, we were taking her to the vet because they did the wrong test and her hips gave out. Aww. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that faded. That's awful. No flex. That's a big flex, man. Oh, you're 16. Gotcha. Does mountain lion I see in my yard count as a pet? Probably. How often does it... How often does it visit? I love how that black buck's just chilling there. Bye, Dustin. It was good to see you. Thanks for hanging out. Have a good night. What happened, William? Oh, my nerves are definitely not the same as they were when I was 20, I swear. I'm way more lumpy now and it drives me nuts. Lumpy. <laughs> Love that. My dog is also very lumpy. My mom just called me and said that my snake just ate my freaking cat. Really? Not surprised. Sounds like a very snake thing to do. Ew, gross, Vegas. What do you mean, Kaylee? Like, what happens whenever your dog gets sick? Where's this for? Oh! Oh, you want a tango? I'll tango. You've tangled with the wrong man! Seriously though, where's the four? Your favorite cat? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, William. I guess that's what happens when you have a predator. It's an ex expression, Johnny. It's an expression. <laughs> Tangled with the wrong man. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. What's up, Daddy? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Lumpy underwire, whatever. You do you, man. <gasps> you do you. <laughs> um no definitely not isn't that that's a Gaston uh Gaston's line in Beating the Beast you've tangled with the wrong you've tangled with the wrong man uh whenever I'm just I'm the I'm the what is it 
Miladin skull or just a big saber tooth? Nice. This point goes like, you don't put down a human for being sick. But what if it's suffer? What if your dog's suffering though? Don't be under Hey, I don't wear underwire, so. Is it okay if I say I love you as a friend? I mean, we, I, we don't really know you yet, William. But I mean, yeah, if you're friends with someone and you're like, I love you, sure. You can love your friends, right? It's a little bit of time. Um, let's go back to the, uh, <laughs> to the Gaston quote. You've tangled with the wrong man. I'm disgraced. Whenever he's, uh, gonna sing about himself and being the beast. Yeah, so like, my dog, not my current dog, my previous Springer Spaniel, Baron, he was really sick. Like, we gave him a bath, he couldn't shake off, he had a tumor, like, he was just not in the best of health. Like, he just could barely stand, like, it was really sad. So, we ended up putting him down. Same with, like, my cat, my previous cat. She was, like, 17 years old diabetic just like super sick and it was just like not fair to her to like you know be regulating her insulin and you know all the things so we put her down not and it's hard it's always hard but like you know to stop the suffering so they don't have to go through that anymore right for a really long day at work Nice, William. That's cool. Dustin. This is my chat usual. This is the normal. Usually we have Nate being in here being weird. In here being weird. Like, it's a whole thing. But we like it like that. As long as it doesn't get out of hand. We appreciate it. <laughs> Oh, no, no, no. I'm talking about, like, end of life. Like, your dog is super sick, as in, like, 14 years old. Because, like, my animals have all been old. Like, 14, 17, like, they've been old. And it's like, they're just not gonna get better. Bet has, you know, like, my dog had a tumor. My cat was sick. My other cat that, she disappeared. But she had, like, kidney failure and thyroid problems. Like, sick. You know, that's what I'm talking about. Not, like, cough due to cold sick. It's up to you, William. Do you have something to do tomorrow? Will it mess up your sleep schedule for the rest of the week? Gotta consider these things. And you've been smoked. Smoked. Must be a chill night. Definitely. The end of our jokes are gonna get very creative, I can tell. <laughs> mm -hmm. Your dog's like eight. Ah, oh, your dog's barely out of puppy stage. What do you mean, Kaylee? You're fine. <laughs> Wonder why aren't you? Why? He's. Your dog is barely out of pup pepperoni stage. Your dog's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> right, Johnny? <laughs> what? My dog lived to be 14. My current dog is 11. They do not. It depends on the breed. Most, A lot of dogs live to be 10. You know, most breeds. It depends on the breeds. Bernie's Mountain Dogs? Maybe six, seven years. Maybe. Big dogs? Yeah. You're not going to have them that long. But like my dog... Springer Spaniel, he's 11 years old. He's thriving. I, my previous Springer lived to be 14. Like, if your dog's living to five, that's not normal. My first Beagle lived to 23, see? Yeah. <laughs> Oops, yeah.
Right? Most dogs. Yeah, your dog should live to be at least 10. My dog is 60 pounds. Like, I can tell his hips are bothering him, but like, he's 77 in human years, you know? What do you expect? Oh, chihuahuas live forever because they're evil. The demon that lives inside them keeps them young. Oh, really, Gunhub? Interesting. Yeah, he should live. Like, especially because he's a mix. If he were straight bulldog, it might be different because bulldogs have health issues, but because he's a mix with Pitbull, he should be fine. Yeah. No, William, you cannot. We have a Discord. If you have Discord, you can join our Discord. I'm often chatting in the general chat and sharing stuff in the Discord if you want to join. You can do exclamation point Discord and join. Um, but no, you cannot. I don't have... I don't have a channel Facebook. I have a personal Facebook, which I don't share. The same with my Instagram. It's personal. I don't have a channel Instagram. Boxers are nice, Faded. Taco. <laughs> You're just saying Faded. That is crazy. Holy crap. Especially if he's a mix. Yeah. Oof. Yeah, Ian, that's gonna be a sad one. It's just sad to watch them slow down. Like my dog jumped on my bed the other day and my bed is pretty tall. Like it's it's high off the ground. And I was shocked that he could and he could jump off and I was like, whoa. Because I'm, like, thinking we'll have to put, like, a ramp up to the window eventually. Sage, cute. <laughs> Johnny, I'm telling. A Chihuahua, Pomeranian, Poodle mix. Holy cow. Poodles are smart. Poodles also live for a very long time, so. You got all the good genes up in there. I'm telling them, Johnny. I'm gonna get in a voice chat with them all. Let them know what you said. Did I just, I just like toss that extra bullet? Gosh. These are so expensive, these rounds. Right, funky. <laughs> My uh, childhood best friend had a miniature poodle growing up. She lived to be like 14. <sighs> yeah, right? Chihuahuas are very like protective of their people, right? Like, they're very territorial. They're very one-person dogs. <laughs> I love how you guys are learning that I, like, know breeds. Like, for whatever reason, I just know dog breeds. I bet you they're really smart, right, Johnny? I assume they're really smart. Your dogs are just like farm dogs, Johnny. So, for those of you who don't know, I bought the 300 
for, what is it, 75k for the 300? And then I got to the mission on Verhongo that told tells you to buy the 470 and there's no discount and the 470 is like 95k and I just bought the 300 I was so pissed I was so upset um and this is like it was really holy cow we're up to 20 likes thank you guys so much um but it was like for the mission so I bought it and you only have to like shoot one thing with it or some sh something and it's so annoying. And then I didn't use it for a while, but it's actually really fun to take along the Cape Coast and just blast capes with it. Doberman or German sh <gasps> My neighbor has a German shorthead pointer. He is stunning. He's like, he's gorgeous, but my neighbor's not nice to that dog and I feel bad. Um, he never, the dog is not trained. When they go for a walk, that dog takes my neighbor for a walk and he's yelling at it. And I'm sure he's mean to it. Like, I'm sure, I'm sure he's not nice. And, um, it makes me really sad because if he just had good training and like a better collar or something, he would be nice. But he doesn't, he, he, he. I've tried to pet him. What makes me think that my the neighbor's not nice is I've tried to pet the dog and he flinches at my hand and it's like, oh, oh. And it's very sad. Like I can do whatever I want to my dog, like not mean, like I could shove my hand down my dog's throat and he doesn't care because I've, you know, been nice to him his whole life and like he trusts me. But that poor, my neighbor's dog, gorgeous. German short hair pointer, liver and salt and pepper, like gorgeous, but does not trust and probably has not had a nice hand on him very often. Good morning, Paul, how are you? Good to see ya. Night faded, thanks for hanging out with us. My dog has one fakest, uh, my, well like not for, my dog has an electric fence, and so he has a shock collar to contain him. Um, and, but when I walk him, we have, he, I use what I call the gentleman collar, and it's one that like pinches him, and he doesn't pull because Springers are pure muscle, and he will pull me. And he knows not to pull. I mean, he knows how to heal and stuff, but, um, that's what my neighbor's dog needs. He needs a gentleman collar, but he like thinks he can, he's the wizard among all dog trainers or whatever the heck. And he thinks he can have control over this dog and he f freaking doesn't. It makes me so sad. Right, Ian? Yeah, like he's a gorgeous dog and like, I just wanted to pet him and he like backed away, flinched away and I'm like, oh, like he might lash out at me, right? But like my dog, I could shove my finger up his butt and he wouldn't care. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> but yeah, my dog has a shock collar because he has an underground fence, electric fence, and it beeps when he gets like within three feet of it. And then if he gets any closer, it zaps him. Yeah. Yep. Oh yeah, like, I know for a fact, I see the dog pull him across the yard and he's like yelling at the dog and it's just like, they're not stupid, you know? Like, dogs are very smart. You just have to teach it and you're just stubborn and think you know what you're doing and you're letting the dog walk you. And it's like, I can literally, could probably walk my dog with my pinky finger using his gentleman collar, but also just telling him to heal and he would listen. And I have never laid a hand on my dog, ever. Because I didn't have to. And I've also seen him, like his dog, his dog got alerted, like, like, he was like startled and he yipped and I saw him like smack him and I'm like no 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 and so I'm sure it's worse like behind closed doors 
And he's tried to use like a shock collar as well. And it's just like, it's so sad. Like the dog is so nice. And the dog is still only like five years old. Like he could still be easily trained. But the, the owner is just stubborn, a stubborn old man. Like, and he also has a shock collar, but like, he doesn't know how to use it. He would just abuse it. Yeah, just get a, there's a, my dog, we call it his gentleman collar. The hardest part is getting him into it. Cause when he knows he's going for a walk, he's so excited and he has such, um, fluffy ears that I'm afraid it's going to get caught in them. <laughs> exactly. Ian. yeah, like the owner is such a, like a blowhole as well. Like he just tells stories all the time and I'm like, who are you trying to impress? Like, I'm not impressed at all. I know how you treat your dog. Like shut the heck up. <laughs> Oh, I don't know. Was it? Maybe. Sorry, I'm thinking about people abusing their dogs. But I have such a soft spot for hunting dogs, the hunting breeds. My favorite is Dalmatians. I want to get one someday. Like, really badly. Um, oh. That's like... He hello? Hi? Um, that's like the goal oh my <sighs> gosh sorry my my <laughs> my mouse did the thing where i went you spin me right round baby oh no johnny hey funk Nice. Ooh, nice, Vegas. What are you gonna do? Hmm? What are you gonna do? Yeah, that's what I thought. Go oh. tap. Yeah, you bark at her, pickles. You're gonna be sick. Sorry, Johnny. <laughs> I don't think it's allowed to have a shock collar in Norway. Never seen one. Yeah, get a pinch collar then. Go to the cabin. All right, have a good day. Have fun, Paul. Good to see you as always. English pointer, yeah. I don't know what an English pointer looks like. I probably looked up. I really like Welsh Cocker Spaniels, they're so cute. Their little like tear shop, teardrop shaped faces are so cute. That's cute, Ian. Chocolate loves are so cute. Yeah, I love floppy ear dogs. Like I can't, I can't. Oh yeah, if you were gonna, if you were gonna get a Doberman, would you have them uh, crop their ears or would you keep them floppy? I know some breeders like automatically do it, but would you have their ears be formed or would you keep them floppy? So I know like German Shepherds, their ears do it on their own. Um, but what about like Dobermans, you have to get them formed. Cause that's like a big point of contention, right? Cause like there's certain breed standards. So like my dog, Springer Spaniel, his ta tail has been docked, um, not well, unfortunately. The You can see where there's like really bad so job, um, but that's the breed standard is to dock their tails so they don't get stuck whenever they're hunting, right? In brushes and stuff. So would you keep them? Maybe it's controversial. Am I starting controversial? Yeah, I would because I want it to be scary looking protection. Yeah. Usually white spotted with brown head. Nice. I love the spaniels in general. Keep them floppy. Yeah. 
<laughs> nice, Kaylee. I had animal control almost take my dog because they had the wrong ad address, and boy, if they would have taken her, animal control would have been down a couple of hands. Wow. Yeah. My buddy had a dog whose ears got cut for that, and it was done wrong, and was, yeah. Also, like, pit bulls, they clip their ears as well. Hey, Buck, how are you? Good to see you. Your face is... <laughs> I can't believe it would be a truck wrecking fest, Buck. What do you mean? What do you mean he's a great driver? That's awesome. Fantastic. Yeah, my poor dog. He has, like, a little, like, bald spot. I think... Do Australian Shepherds don't have tails, I don't think. I think Australian Shepherds, like, um... English Sheepdogs don't have tails. I think they are born without them. I have little... Pity who's intimidation levels are soft zero. Haha, <laughs> cute. They do? Okay. I couldn't- Oh, I'm thinking of blue healers. I don't think- I think their tails are pretty short. Like, naturally. Born with short tails. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm imagining my neighbor down the street. They have an um, Australian Shepherd. Not my neighbor, but the grandchildren of my neighbor down the street have an Australian Shepherd. Libby. She's cute. The dog seems Libby. The German Shep short haired pointers, Ike. <laughs> But I don't, I won't even buy one no matter how good it runs because I use the white tip tail and field. I've never seen them with a docked. I've always seen them with their tails in the normal length. Interesting. Yeah, you. I think you'd want, because they're lower to the ground, right? I think you'd want to see, be able to see them when they're running. It's funny, my dad wanted to get another Springer because he's like, oh, we'll go hunting. And then my dog is gun shy and doesn't like any booms and is like such a nervous mess. But we love him. He's just a baby now. <laughs> Night, Ian. I can't believe you're still wearing it after all this time. Sheesh. Man, you're supposed to be re relaxing. Not having such hold going on, but... Good night, Ian. Good to see you as always. Have a good Sunday. Heck yeah, you're like, what, an hour ahead of me? Jeesh, man. I'll probably be ending here shortly anyway, because... Stuff. Nice. Yeah, they have that, like, joke where people are like, you know... When your dog, all you hear is like the thumping of the tail, and I'm like, I have no idea what that means. Because my dog doesn't have, well, I can hear his tail thumping like on the couch, but it's not like thumping dressers, you know? Alright, night, Jaden. Thanks for hanging out with us. Have a good day tomorrow and a good sleep. Because tail bleeds and they lose blood from briar. Yeah. Yeah, that's why I assume they chop the uh, springers so they don't get caught whenever they're in brambles and stuff. My dog is boom shy because of some idiot decided to shoot off an extreme left. Yeah. Ooh, nice, Johnny. Bye, Kaylee. Oh, good to see you. Have a good night. It's just too fun. <laughs> With this extremely expensive ammo. But, you know. Bear grind, am I right? <laughs> An orange eye? That's awesome. Huskies are loud, right? You know, so you know how, like, on Thanksgiving... You watch like the Thanksgiving Day Parade, right? And then everyone watches football. I like to watch the dog show. That's my favorite. 
I love watching the dog show. Like, who cares about football? Dog show. So that's why like I love learning about breeds because I watch the dog show. <laughs> like that's my thing. That is my jam. Is the dogs. Puppy bowl for the win as well. Right. Yeah, my dog, so my dad tried to take my dog out hunting. Um, once, and he was hooked, and as soon as he heard, my dog heard gunfire, he was at my dad's heel, and my dad, like, my dad doesn't even hunt birds usually anyway, because Echo Springers are a flushing breed, they flush the birds, um, that's their job, but, like, also my dog is, like, part bench, so he's, like, half show half field half hunting and so like and I guess like his dad or something was really good but yeah he just like was immediately afraid of the gunfire so my dad just then my dad got busy or whatever and he just couldn't take him out anymore and 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 you know try to get him used to it so it just never happened squirrel hunting dog and she only is two years old so I might be able to have her get used to oh definitely for sure hey nutty <laughs> nutty buddy hey nut butter how are you <laughs> did you like that I just came out of lurk mode and can't just stream today because I lurk you know I'm the master lurker <laughs> like I saw my name highlighted I'm like Ur? Night, Vegas. Thanks for hanging out with us. Mm hmm. Nice, Dustin. Yeah. Yeah, my dog. My dad was hoping that, like, if he got my dog on a bird, that he would be like preoccupied with the bird, but that just didn't happen. Cause I guess our previous Springer, like, he was just like zoom on a bird and like was great fantastic but like yeah my dad just wasn't gonna be bird hunting I jump scared you <laughs> good <laughs> you're not safe anywhere <laughs> I love that that's hilarious you're doing decent let's go you're uh your um, appointment's on Monday, right? I hope you get some answers, man. Probably either a Springer or Brittany Spaniel. Man, those grays do look albino, don't they? Shoot, I had a double take there. Definitely gray, though. Night, Flanky. Thanks for thanks for the lurk. Appreciate ya. Sweet nut butter. Yeah. Hopefully they're like, hey, you're you're anemic, or like, yeah, your iron count suck balls. That's exactly what they're gonna say. I'm scared because he was shot and I guess beaten. Oh. Fully healed the gun wound. I bought him a hunting dog advent we have here. Oh, really, Nut Butter? It's full of dogs. Nice. Hopefully, the kitty cats don't get your doggies, Johnny. Since we know you attract kitty cats. Thanks, how are you? Happy Sunday. It was Buck nice, Dustin? Love that. Nice, nut butter. Let's go. Congrats. 
didn't you win? Was it you won in Clinton's stream? Is that right? I've never played Fall Guys still. Y'all are on fire with the chats tonight. Holy cow. Appreciate you. Also with the likes. Very much appreciate that as well. Holy cow. I feel the love. Nice. Yeah, I wasn't there. Um, I left to go home from work and I just didn't return. We're not going to bring up what happened in, Kate in Clinton's second stream though. Johnny, go plug your sh ish in. <laughs> Gosh. I'm probably actually gonna end here shortly. I'm sorry, we didn't like shoot too many things, but like, it was late. <laughs> when I started, I thought I was gonna start far earlier, so. Hey, Jebba. You like bedtime stories? Once upon a time. Yeah. My phone is actually like 30s. 37. Eek. <laughs> Unfortunately, he got sick and died during a rare ice storm here in South Carolina. I brought him in house and he died a few days later. Aw. Sorry to hear that, Dustin. It's never easy. Especially all the love you put into him. Oh, okay, that that makes sense, Johnny. That makes sense. Jebba, how's the Val how's the Valheiming been? You digging it? I haven't been there to destroy your homes, so it should be good. Also, Jebba, there's a brand new command just for you. Just for you and Nate and anybody else who wants to sp spam it. More than the forest, nice. Isn't it chill? I love the soundtrack from the Valheim. Well, it's more fantastical as well, right? More like on the wow type of spectrum. I'm just, I'm just running around, Eric. Yeah, I mean, I'm just kind of checking the coast for wet beef. I had like a plan and then I got sidetracked. Um, yeah. <laughs> I was gonna go to, I was, I was gonna, oh no. Um, I was gonna hunt like multiple species, but then like I was invited to play Bigfoot on Kill Clinton's stream earlier, so I played Bigfoot and then I didn't start streaming till later, so we're only getting around to the to the, the water buffalo, which I don't mind. I really like water buffalo, so I'm just blasting and chatting with you guys, pretty much. <laughs> nice. Yeah, so you get. Have you started sailing yet at all, Jebba? Because you can like sail and like go away from home. <gasps> Black buck. <sighs> when a crate falls in the sea. No. Oh wait, it's Wendy's that's never frozen. Yeah. Not yet. We'll be doing that soon. We're working on troll bronze armor. Very good. Very nice. Okay, let me look at Pro XEK's hotspot here. Okay. <laughs> They're where I suspect them to be. Nice. We might go look at some lakes for them like this lake maybe because I've run this coast before and I haven't found them so I haven't found any trophies 
how do you never freeze the meat? I don't know. They just like slaughter cows in the back of the <laughs> store. I don't know. Uh, Eric, are you on PC? On PC, you just push G. Um, you push G and it makes you auto walk and then caps lock is toggle for running. And then sprint is running, uh, not toggled run. Okay, guys, I'm winged. All right, night, Dustin. Thanks for hanging out with us. Sorry we uh, pulled you back in, but it was good seeing you as always. Your console. I'm not sure. Right, not better? That's true. Yeah, I'm not sure what it is on console. I'm sorry. They also make it seem like round patties are bad. I think they mean... Because, like, you know how, like, things get freezer burnt? I think that's what they're, like, trying to avoid. Or, like, it hasn't been frozen for a long time. Hey, Jan. Welcome. I'm probably gonna hop off here shortly, but... Oh, welcome. Have you been lurking this whole time? Storm Bluff Isle was against my server last night. Oh, nice. That's kind of ironic. Very cool. Oh, I used to love A&W's burgers. But r and was also with a long John Silvers and they got really nasty really fast, so... No, thank you. Are you in trouble? No. <gasps> yes. Of course not. We appreciate lurkers. I was just curious if you'd been lurking and... And listening to me rant about dog breeds and stuff. That's all. Welcome in. Good to see you. Hope you had a good Saturday. Hope you have a good Sunday. As it is Sunday for us East Coasters. <laughs> Whoa. Not my doing. We already had Ian talking about his underwire earlier, so. NW is a burger chain. NW root beer. See ya, Gun Hub. Thanks for hanging out. There's no wet beef here yet. like nothing good in terms of fast food places like Wendy's, just McDonald's and Burger King and KFC. You're not missing much. You're not missing much. Because none of them are good for you. Yeah, Johnny, they're like known for their root beer floats, but they, they're like a 50s burger joint. Like they try to be like the 50s. Oh yeah. I haven't had KFC in like over a decade and it's gross. <laughs> oh, gross, <laughs> gross, nut butter, nasty. <laughs> Absolutely disgusting. <laughs> I feel like most, I feel like Germany probably does food, okay, well. Yeah, here, our A&W is also Long John Silvers. No, I agree, Nut Butter. A&W is awesome. If, it was just my chain went downhill, like, management, ownership, workers, they just like didn't take pride in their work, you know, so it just sucked. <laughs> this is awful. Uh, 
And now, they tore it down and now there's a Burger King. <laughs> and it's funny because there's an auto parts store where the old Burger King used to be. Shut up, CC Cleaner. Get the heck out of here. There's an auto parts store where there used to be a Burger King. Sorry, I had a pop-up of CC Cleaner for whatever heckin' reason. Shut up. I see you over there. Are you fleeing? Why? Weird. Okay. Alright guys, I'm kind of crashing, so I think I'm going to go ahead and end the stream here because I can't keep up the energy, so I'm going to end up the stream here. You deserve better, so... I'm going to end the stream here. I hope you guys have a good night. Have a good Sunday tomorrow. You know I'll probably stream. Um, yeah. I'm ending. I'm ending, Johnny. Perfect timing. Let's go. Yep. Have a good day, Eric. Have a good day for those of you in the daytime. Have a good night for those of you who it's nighttime. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, I'll see you in the Discord. See you in other people's streams. All the norm. Uh, check out, I posted a short today. Check that out. Check it out. You might like it. We're almost at 30 likes on the stream. Thank you so much. Um, but yeah, guys, have a good night. Thanks for hanging out with me as always. I will see you whenever. Bye.